Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a great week so far. So it's Monday and it's the start of the week so I thought I would share with you everything that I'm going to eat for my tea or my dinner today. So this is a homemade bolognese or the meat is bolognese anyway. So it's turkey mince, garlic salt, salt and pepper, tomatoes, tomato puree, oregano, that kind of thing. It's been in the slow cooker. I batch do these about once a month so I can just pull them out whenever I fancy a bolognese. Uh, I've done rice because gluten-free spaghetti is not that brilliant. I can't seem to cook it so it's perfect. It's either al dente, which I'm not too keen on, or it's sloppy and gooey. So as I love my rice, I served it with my rice. I've got some fresh parmesan shavings over the mince. Uh, and I've got some red Leicester cheese because I can't have a meal without red Leicester cheese. And I've also got some fresh red chilli on there because I do like a kick, I do like a bite. And then I've got some lightly salted nacho chips or tortilla chips. Um, salt and pepper, there's also lime juice on there as well because I love my lime juice. So this is the start of the week, so it's a, a, a bolognese with a twist instead of the spaghetti. It's the rice, so yeah, that's my tea tonight. Tea tonight is two slices of sourdough, cob or something, it's a gluten free one by Warburton's, it's £3.50, it's quite expensive but never mind, it is nice. Um, a poached egg which is actually quite good for me, it's stayed intact and it's quite soft and then I've grilled some baby sweet cherry tomatoes uh, and on that toast there is some garlic mayonnaise and some basil flakes as well, I don't know if you can see them but yeah, that is a really quick and simple tea for tonight. Tea tonight is a haddock loin, which I just put in the oven on a bed of spinach and some sliced cherry tomatoes. There is lemon juice, some garlic salt, lots of butter, and just put it in the oven really for about 10 minutes and it's cooked. Creamy mash parmesan potato, because I'm, I'm absolutely starving, so this is a carb-filled meal. Loads of parmesan in my mashed potato. And then my vegetables are sweet corn, mange too, and courgette, which I fried up really in a tiny little squirt of oil and a little knob of butter and just kind of dry fried it until they were all crispy and, and cooked really. So yeah, this is haddock loin and mashed potato really for tea. Tea tonight is a homemade sweet and sour vegetable. So it's just plain boiled basmati rice. And then the vegetables is baby corn, pineapple, red pepper, green pepper, garlic, onions, ginger, and there's a few habanero chilies in there. And then my sauce, um, my homemade sweet and sour sauce is rice wine vinegar, demerara sugar, the juice from the pineapple, there's a few more chilies in there, um, a little squirt of tomato puree just to give it that little bit of extra kick. And then I've made it really thick or quite thick with potato starch. You can use corn flour, but potato starch makes it clear whereas the cornstarch will make it cloudy and almost like a white colour so I tend to use potato starch if you want a clear sauce and that's it really, it's got salt and pepper on there I'm going to put some more habanero chilies on the rice because I don't think I can have a meal without being some kind of spice so no jars, just everything that you've got in your fridge it's so very very easy, I cook this in about 10 minutes as long as it takes the rice to cook anyway so yep, a nice tea for tonight so tea tonight is a soup. I realised when I went through the fridge that I had a lot of onions and spring onions and bits and pieces that I really didn't want to throw away. They were kind of on the turn. So I went through Google and YouTube and, and found a soup that was actually a weight loss soup. Um, however, it's not a weight loss soup for me because I've added macaroni. So it's just garlic, um, red onion, little tiny shallot onions, spring onion, there's cumin, there's a hot pepper, there's half a vegetable stock cube, there's two glasses of water, salt, pepper, one mashed tomato and then a tablespoon of tomato puree and then right at the very end I just added some elbow pasta which of course is gluten free so I guess it's like um, a minestrone but it's used up a lot of my rubbish and I've also got a little bit of lettuce in there. Um, a lettuce in soup is really really nice if you cook it just at the very very end. I love lettuce in a soup so yeah a really cheap meal. I've got loads of it for tea although this isn't a very big portion it'll do for now uh, and I've got some to take to work in the morning so yeah that's a cheap and quick easy tea. 
Tea tonight is a roasted garlic, so I've just cut the top off a large bulb of garlic, smothered it in olive oil, some thyme and lots of honey and then put it in a hot oven for about 20 minutes and it all caramelises and then when you squeeze these little bulb things it should pop out, it's really nice. And then I've just done a mixed salad which is tomatoes, spring onion, cheese, red pepper, orange pepper, beetroot and I think that's it and then it's got a balsamic and olive oil dressing just over the top so yeah a nice quick and easy tea for me tonight. So tea tonight is huge it's just boiled new potatoes that are really really nice and there's a knob of butter on there as well. There's a couple of mushrooms that just went in with a burger but there was more than that but I've eaten those and that little sauce is a sun-dried tomato and roasted garlic sauce or something that I bought from Morrison's it's quite sweet but really nice. And then a Linda McCartney mozzarella burger, which is huge. Underneath there, there's rocket, there's dill peppers, there's sun-dried tomatoes, a little bit of cheese. I think that's it, really. And then obviously cheese on top, because I can't have a meal without my cheese. So it's a, a very, very big tea, which is just lovely. So that's the end of the week. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed my meals and take care.